What's up, crypto heads? John Fro here from Crypto Dreams, where anything is possible. Today, we're going to be looking at Crypto Blades. You can now participate in raids and earn rewards. We're going to be taking an in depth look at that. Please subscribe, like, and hit the notification button. Let's get to it. Alrighty, let's take a look. Here we go multi character sign up. You can sign up all of your characters, each with a different weapon. Signing up will drain stamina and durability. You don't need the total amount, but it will keep you at zero for a while once it reaches that. So this is important to keep in mind. If you sign up all your characters, they are basically going to be locked. They will. It's going to drain all of your durability and stamina, so you will not be able to use them. So if you want to combat, you will not be able Raids start every 8 hours. Early joiners get a bonus to increase the rare drop chance. Joining early is risky. If not enough players join, you might lose the boss fight. Every boss will have a different element. These will be completely randomized. The element will be shown with our element icons. So, a couple things here. Yeah, I mean, if you join early, your chance of getting better rewards are gonna you're gonna they're gonna increase you're gonna have a better opportunity to get higher drops higher level drops but you also have the chance of not enough people joining and you would lose your gas fee in my opinion i'm willing to take that chance and get in early to possibly get higher rewards and lose 75 75 cents to a dollar because that's about what your gas fees are going to be. Just keep in mind, if you have four characters in, that's going to be four times the gas fee. So you would lose, you know, maybe $4. So there, there's that to consider as well. All right, so rewards. Weapons, two to five star. Junk, one to five star. Used for reforging, creating dust. Trinket, one to five star. With special effects for your character. Only one per raid will be dropped. So that's extremely rare. Thousands of people join these raids. So if you get that trinket, holy, holy moly, you're stoked. You're going to be loving life. I know I will be if I get one. I hope to God that I get one. Secret key loot box. This will drop a key to a dungeon. So there's not a lot of information on dungeons yet, but I know I want to be involved in them. And key loot box is going to get you into a dungeon, so I'm looking for those. I, I want to get those. Dust. LB, 4B, 5B, and various amounts. Experience. You will still gain experience even if the fight is lost. So that's really cool. Um, if you lose the fight, you're still going to get that experience. So not a total loss even if the fight is lost. Alrighty, so let's scroll down here. We're going to look at rewards. Every character has a chance at two drops, a common and a rare drop, but only if the raid is one. Common items are LB dust, two to three star swords, junk. Rare drops are four to five star swords, junk, key boxes, and 4B and 5B dust. Your chance depends on the character's power with weapon compared to the average. Average is around 14,000 right now. Common drops are always at least 25%. Rares are 0.74 at average power. Common is 87%. Rare is 8.36%. At two times average, common is 93%. Rare is 14.8%. Remember, this is per character, so a team of four gets a chance at four common and four rare drops. So the stronger your characters are, the higher, the stronger your character and the stronger your weapon, the higher probability you're going to have to get those rare drops. So again, getting strong weapons and, and high level characters is going to reward you just like in your battles when you're when you're fighting in combat. Also, if you have four characters in, you're going to have four chances 
to get those drops. So that's that's a big deal. That's a big deal. All right. So in case of victory, 5% players also get bonus XP. 2.5% get 300 XP. 1.5% get 600 XP. 0.5% get 900 XP. 0.3% get 1500 XP. 0.15% get 3000 XP. And 0.05% get 6000 XP. I think this is awesome that they have implemented this into the game. Uh, grinding on experience once you get to those high once you get to those higher levels past 40 and 50 it takes a while so if you get this 6000 xp i mean that's 100 battles right now so that's a big deal i love this i really love this all right let's jump over to the to the game itself and look at a raid so right here down at the bottom in this corner, you can see my power. I have 56,736. I currently have these two characters right here in the raid. And this four-star sword and my five-star. As you can see, the durability is completely drained in both of my weapons. So keep in mind... They're going to be locked. My characters were completely drained. They are slowly gaining stamina. So that is coming back. But keep that in mind. You will not be able to combat. All right. So let's look over here. So the status of this raid, you can see, is it's in preparation phase still. So right now there's 8,020 people. It's still in preparation. So more people will continue to join. This boss power is... This high total power is this high from all the people, all these people that have joined. We want to get that up higher. There's still quite a bit of time, so it should get there. I joined when this was in the hundreds, so that increases my odds to get those rare drops, which is what I want. These are your drops here, and if you look here, uh, joining early gives up to a 10% bonus, so... That's that earned early joining uh, benefit. And if we look here, I noticed this just moments ago. Um, if your character performs exceptionally well, they will be rewarded with up to plus 24% bonus XP. So that's, that's awesome. That's just awesome. I'm assuming that that's at 6,000. So, so cool. I think this is... A really cool addition to the game. It adds a lot. It's just a different, whole different gameplay than the combat. Um, and you got to think a little more if you want to be able to do some combat. And also provides uh, different rewards and, and is very cool. So we're going to jump over here into the blacksmith and look. Equipment is where you will see what you have gotten. I have gotten a key box so far and some dust and i've participated in two raids that is what i received pretty stoked on my key box um and if we jump back to the raid here show you down here at the bottom is where you're going to see a claim button once everything is finished up and you'll hit that claim you'll again have to pay a fee it's pretty low and you will be able to claim your rewards well, that's about it, everybody. I just wanted to give you a rough overview of the new update to Crypto Blades. I am personally very excited about it. It offers new gameplay and a new chance to get different rewards. I have been playing this game since the beginning and have seen it grow and expand, and I know it will continue to do so. The Crypto Blades team is one of the hardest working and best out there. I appreciate you all listening and watching. And if you got a comment, please leave it below. I would appreciate it. Also, subscribe, like, and hit that notification button. Thank you very much. Peace. Crypto.